Hi, kitty cats. Okay, another reading about women in science, right? And um, I just um, uh, want to read about Lise Meitner, the physicist. And uh, she was she discovered she, uh, she discovered and explained the working of nuclear fission. She discovered the element protectinium with her lab partner Otto Hahn, and she should have received a Nobel Prize, but she, I guess she didn't. She said, "Life need not be easy, provided only it was not empty." That's what she said. Okay, so we're going to read about Lise Meitner. Lise Meitner was born in 1878. Like many Jewish families at the time, hers was living happily in Vienna. Lise loved science, science but knew that as a girl, she would need to fight to be able to pursue an education. After Lise received her PhD, she went to work at the Chemistry Institute in Berlin in 1907. There she met Otto Hahn, who would become her collaborator throughout her career. Even though she was brilliant, being a woman meant she was unpaid and not allowed to use the labs or even the bathrooms until the government officially permitted women to attend the university she did all of her radiochemistry research in a dark basement in 1934 the scientist focused on discovering new heavy elements Lise and Otto were trying to artificially create new elements by smashing neutron gas uranium. They did not know it yet, but they were on the brink of a brand new discovery. Lisa's research was interrupted by the Nazi, Nazis' rise to power because she was Jewish. Lise needed to escape, but did not want to leave her work. In 1938, with a heavy heart, she fled to Sweden and Otto continued their work in Germany. She and Otto secretly wrote letters back and forth about their research. He struggled to understand the results of their experiments. Lise realized that they were not creating a new element, but that their work was causing the nucleus of one atom to stretch apart and release energy. From afar, Lise discovered nuclear fission the nuclear reaction that releases nuclear energy. Lise was unable to return to Germany and Otto was awarded the 1944 Nobel Prize for their work without her. Lise refused to ever work in Germany again, unable to forgive the country for what it had done to her people. Although she did not win the Nobel Prize, Lise wrote papers on fission that were read all over the world and she won many other awards her brilliant mind gave us a new form of energy and change physics forever so that was her contribution she was a physicist um she is the german version of marie curry according to uh, albert einstein she knew albert einstein she helped Austria in World War I as an x-ray nurse. Uh, energy from the fission experiment was described as 20 million times more powerful than TNT. Um, had an element matenarium, named after her own honor today, compared nuclear fission to the stretching of pizza dough. She escaped from Germany with the help of physicist Neil Bohr and dined with President Truman as the Women of the Year. So that is about her and Lise Meitner, a woman, a brilliant woman of a physicist, right? So
that's it for now. Until next time, good night, sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. Mm.